Hi friends and welcome or welcome back to a brand new episode of our Fairy Core Let's Play. In today's episode we are going to build a kitchen. <laughs> I really want to work on the interiors of this base more. I want to get better at decorating interiors. I don't feel like I'm the best at it. I feel like I could definitely improve. So today we're going to start off with this kitchen and then if we get time we might rearrange the enchanting room as well but we'll see how we go <laughs> i have had a little trouble deciding on what color scheme to do in here and if i have a look i was like typing in like kitchen to see the kitchen counters because i thought that would be a good place to start and i'm not sure if i should maybe make green kitchen like green and white as like the kitchen counters um and then we can obviously like add a lot of decorations because i still want it to be kind of i still want it to look like a bit like kind of mossy and overgrown similar to how i've got like the like leaves on the floor and the mossy bed in the bedroom i want to have still have that like kind of cozy overgrown vibe in here as well so we might give that a go i have a lot of random stuff in here not all of this is obviously for today but I will turn some cactus into green dye. Oh, no, I have to smelt that first. I am silly. Okay, so while that's cooking, I will grab some chests because I need those as part of the crafting recipe. I'll just use some of these random ones that I crafted too many of when I was doing my rainbow. And then we need white concrete. Oh, and I forgot that I need terra. Oh, no, wait, is that in my backpack already? Yeah, terracotta, awesome. Oh, in between episodes too, I did do a little bit. So I have added a whole heap of upgrades to our backpack, which is pretty awesome. We now have a crafting table in here, um, as well as a magnet um, upgrade, a compacting upgrade, and like the stack upgrade all the way up to diamond. So that is pretty awesome. Ooh, that makes four at a time. Okay. Um, ooh, and that makes eight. Wow. Okay. A little bit more green dye. Maybe make another stack of that one. And then to make the matching sink. Ooh, and a fridge. We can do a fridge. So we need to make some green terracotta. And then that opens up. Ooh, shingles. Interesting. <laughs> but the sink is what we're after first. And then. I think we're gonna obviously want like a stove. Do the farmer's delight one, which needs bricks and a campfire. Okay, I can go grab those. Now I can make a stove, so I'll add that into the kitchen as well. I kind of wish I had other stove options, but I don't think I do, which is fine. I'll pop that there. I think I'm going to just have it along the back wall. Put the fridge. Oh wow, <laughs> they all have different sounds. We have our sink. Do we do something like that? No, I don't like that. Um maybe if i swap those two around and put the sink there and the stove there that's a little bit better okay now i want to test out something because we have the jacaranda walls i don't know if i need to change them in here to go with the color scheme i probably do i think it might clash a little bit too much with the green um, and then I wasn't sure if I should use some overhead cabinets and which colours I should use of those. Because there is just like all of the regular um, wood ones in the Farmer's Delight pack as well. I think I like those two the best. But now I'm not sure what colour I would change the walls to. 
Okay, I've just realized that I can make a whole bunch of different kitchen stuff in the jacaranda or the umber and wood. So maybe I should give those a go instead of trying to change up the colors. Oh, that's a weird noise. Okay, that's kind of cute. Let me check what the umbran wood looks like as well. We can like do that or there's even like that kitchen cabinet. Ooh, that's actually not bad. Okay, let's make some more of those. And we can pick a different sink as well. Which color for the cabinets? I guess the purple and then we can leave the wall the color it is. So let's do that. And then if we have a look at the sink situation. That's an umber and one with a dark sink top. Oh, one with the white. Interesting. Okay. I need some more iron though. Oh, now I'm not sure about the layout again. <laughs> oh, do I do a double stove. That could be a thing. And then have the sink there. Oops, so daisy. All right, I'll craft another sink. Did I say sink? I meant stove. <laughs> and then we can make some sort of like range hood exhaust fan situation here but it has to be too wide I think that works yeah okay I'm pretty happy with that one well, then like obviously once there's stuff on the counters and like decorations and stuff I think that'll help as well so next I think I want like a dining table, maybe to the side with a couple of chairs. And then what should I put on this side? All right, we'll figure out the table situation first. <laughs> so we'll give this one a go. Just need some more sticks. Yeah, that's what I'm after, but I need one more. Stranger that they come in three, but that's fine. Is that a little bit close to there? Should I move it over this way? We'll see which chairs we use, because if they're low profile enough, it should be okay. We'll test out these ones. <laughs> Why do they face that way? That's annoying. Okay. Hey. <laughs> Just sitting at my table. <laughs> um, I'll leave it for now. The next thing I'm going to have to decide is like flooring. Do I just go full on leaves or do I do an actual rug? One thing I do want to have a look at is there's like a lot of the chipped. Is it carpet? Yeah. So there's like a lot of these or our normal leaf ones. And then I do also have a texture pack on for our default um, carpets as well. That has like fringe, which is pretty cute. 
Let's have a look what the jacaranda leaf carpet looks like. I could tie in some of like the purples or it might be ridiculous. Yeah, no, I hate it. <laughs> okay, let's see what else we can craft, even just for decorations along the back wall. I can figure out what I'm going to put on the other wall later. I think if I do some knives, there's like... Where is it? Oh, I wanted to do a trash can too, actually. Quickly do that. Nope. Um, that is in the furniture making one. Ooh, lockers, metal mailbox, and a small locker. That's really cool. Okay, so yeah, I'm pretty sure there's like the knife wall thing. Um, nope, that's, I think it's in, is it dusty? Yeah, this one, hanging knives. So three planks. Why is it not showing up then? Do I? I don't know. We'll do it this way. There we go. So what else? I need the cooking pot for sure. Um, the farmer's delight one. Yeah. Ooh, two bricks and a wooden shovel and a water bucket. Wow. Okay. Um, Alright, I'll pop down these items first. I just might put that there for now. The knives, cute, okay. I have a water bucket. Um, can I turn that back into bricks? No. Do I have bricks? Anywhere. Yes. And a wooden shovel. Was that everything? Yes. Oh, and they're kind enough to give us the water back. Oh, that's so cool. So we can like cook different meals in the pot. All right, I love that. Ooh, terracotta bowl. I wonder what that looks like. Yeah, that's cool. I wonder if I can put food or something in it. Oh, a chopping board, actually. Um, I think there's one that you can do that has like a knife in it as well. Oh. Chopping board. Can we like put the skillet on there? I don't really know how to use a skillet, but we can figure it out. <laughs> Maybe a little lantern. Don't know if I'll keep that there, but it can go there for now. I think we want there's an aquaculture one. I don't know if that's the same. Farmer's delight one. We'll do that. Pop the knife on the cutting board. Lovely. to put something in the hanging plant. I have to do the cat mugs because <laughs> they're purple and they're cute. Um, not sure. I might actually put shelving here maybe? Let's see what shelves we've got. I mean, I'll try those as well. But that was not the one I was after. I think I need to install another mod to help me with the conflicting um, things. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's not going to work up there. Okay, I just installed a thing. Hopefully it works where we can make yeah there we go shelves so you can like um switch the recipes that way awesome so i'll have to make sure that the mod pack is updated before this episode goes live 
So let's try out this other shelf. I mean, it's cute. It's dainty. Can I... How would that look on there? Oh, they do stick out a bit though. Okay, maybe not the cups. <laughs> but I do like that shelf. It's a little bit more compact, I guess. Um, it's hard because these walls are only three high, so it doesn't give me a lot of options. Could put some over here too, actually. It would limit what I could put there though. Hmm, okay. <laughs> um... Greenery. Let's get some greenery going. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a bit all over the place. My brain is hurting, but I am having fun and we're just rolling with it today. Maybe. Okay, and some plants. What have we got? Could probably put some glow lichen around actually. That could be cool. Um, don't need lily pads. I need like actual flowers. Maybe a couple of those or something. Where's the vines at? I'll grab a few of those. Okay. So I think I can just like put anything in these. Nope. Okay. Not that one. Maybe it has to be a vanilla flower. Interesting. Yeah. There we go. What was that? I swear I just saw something like run across there. That was weird. Um... Lighting, I'm not sure how I'm going to do that because the ceiling's not very high. I could hide some glowstone behind leaves in the roof. That's what I did up here as well. Um, so let's try that actually. Plus we'll put like a few cute little things around but... Oh no. <laughs> I keep forgetting it does that. Ah, okay. Well, we'll start with that and then I have to put the whole roof back. <laughs> um, we may as well do like another one, maybe like there. Yeah, so that's definitely adding more light. Plus a little bit of foliage in there I had. Does that fit on the shelf? Oh no, that's not. Whoops. <laughs> um. No, okay, that's <laughs> not doing what I want it to do. That's that's fine. <laughs> Maybe we'll pop one on the table. Oh my gosh, stop it. A fern, dirt, and terracotta. We need that. Okay. <laughs> um, I've got terracotta in my backpack. So I just need fern and a dirt. Do I have any dirt in here? Oh, it needs to be orange terracotta. My mistake. Okay. I have that as well. So many recipes to remember. <laughs> the cat, black cat one's pretty cute too, actually. I don't think I have black, black terracotta though. No, only brown. That's okay. The orange one's still really cute. Um, do I put it on the table? Whoa, no, that's huge. <laughs> I mean, I love it. Don't get me wrong. Um. <laughs> it's so big. Does it get smaller if I put it on the shelf? Or oh, it probably won't. Yeah, no. <laughs> that's so funny. I mean... I kind of don't hate it up there. I'm getting distracted. I was trying to find that little tiny pot plant that I used over in the other um, house build as well. I thought I had everything for it. Okay, surely now we have a few other options. Yeah, here's this one. We can try that one with the string. Um, I think I had some string in here. Yep.
Can I change the height of it somehow? Do I need the ropes for that? Or do I just like place it lower? Oh yeah, there we go. Oh, that's cute. I like that. And then I think I should be able to put this little one on this shelf because that shelf is cluttered. Nope. <laughs> How am I so bad at using these shelves? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Ooh, that's cute. I want to make those. All right, glowstone and glass panes. Can I please have all of the glowing moons? Yes. Oh my gosh, stop it. That is so cute. I want those everywhere. Maybe not like everywhere, everywhere, but. Adorable. Okay. Um, What else can we make? Ooh, plant jar. Hello. that cluttered it is so maybe if I get another shelf we can do that on a shelf Oh, why are some of these so huge? No, I don't like that though. Okay, um, I think I need some like actual glass and we can get some of those like glass jar ones, I think. I've got the big jars. Oh, what is that? Teacup? Oh my god, how cute! Another jar? I'm gonna need more shelves. <laughs> I mean, I'll make another one actually just to have. Oh, glass bottles, duh. I should probably, I think, make those. And then I think you can change them into like, yeah. Some of like those. I don't know how to make the filled ones. Red and a yellow dye, or brown and yellow dye. Oh, those ones are cute. Black and red. Two terracotta and two glass. Let's make those. Oh my god. Are they seriously that big? Okay, never mind. I mean, they could probably look cute up there and we can put our cat somewhere else. There we go. Can't even tell that they're jars. Oh well, it looks like kind of like boxes of food actually. We'll leave that there. I've got like the little empty glass jars. I can put up another shelf maybe over here. Why do I suck at this so much? <laughs> okay, um... Obviously making food to put on the table and stuff will look cute as well. All right, I'll grab some more string and see what that looks like. That could be cute. And I think there was like a hanging herbs thing as well somewhere. Yeah, some of these. I need some grass. And that one, peonies and string. Okay. Don't tell me I don't have peonies. How do I not have peonies? Okay, I'm gonna go find peonies. 
I'll be right back. Okay, I have peonies now. <laughs> oh, but I didn't get grass. Do I have shears on me in my backpack? No, I can just make more, but I have so many shears. I really should use some of them up. <laughs> um, let's grab a set and then I'll grab some grass from outside because I think I needed those for, for one of the recipes. we go Ooh, flowering carpet i mean i'll have a look at that but that's not what we're after we're after these oh all my string must be in my backpack yeah So we can do that drying herb and then the other one required sticks. Okay, let's see how these look. Um, oh, it's big. Okay. I mean, can I do it like in front of that? That could be cute actually, but obviously. Oh, I was like, where did that go? Do we like that? I think I like that. What does this one look like? Yeah, that's a little one. That's cute. Okay. Um, need more light over here actually. I might put another light up there in a minute. Pop it there for now. <laughs> That'll do. <laughs> um, yeah, I really need to figure out a rug situation here, though. Do I just do moss? Or do I do actual carpet? Alright, let's try and make some of... Oh, <laughs> hey. Do I have any of that rice stuff or could I do it? I think it said it with maize. Because I don't have any of the rice stuff on me. Can you, I want the knife off. <laughs> Ooh, okay. I think if you like do it like Ooh, I can stand the knife up. That's cute. Okay. Um So now I'm probably going to need a lot more hay. No, is that not it? make camp oh it's a four by okay or two by two sorry and then ooh okay let's see how this looks might make it a bit bigger so if I make a little bit more Oh, I was gonna see what that looked like too. Oh my god, stop it. That is so cute! Oh my gosh. That is adorable. Um, corn. That's what I was doing. Can I get the knife? Okay. 
that too big? Or do we like it? Oh wait, I picked up the other flowers. Awesome. <sighs> I think I like it. I need to light that candle. Still need something for that shelf. And maybe something still in this corner. I think it's coming together though. I don't know about that bowl being there, but we're gonna probably make some food in a minute. So I'll probably put food there. Or I could move the jars because I think they should fit up here. Yeah. Okay. So we'll pop the jars there and then maybe put like a cake or something over there. That would be really cute. And then some like plated food on the table. Maybe some sort of like light in that corner, like a hanging light or a fairy light or something. Ooh, moonstring. Let's give that a go. That sounds really cute. Oh wait, I was gonna put... <laughs> I was like, why is there a hole here? <laughs> um, I need a log back. And I'll put a piece of stone back as well because otherwise that'll bug me. Can you like... Oh yeah, that's cute. But maybe I need to move this moon now. But put like a moon... Or can I put it behind? Is that weird? Maybe a painting here? <laughs> that one's kind of funny. That one's kind of cute actually. Now I think I'm going to empty out my pockets and then start moving food over into the drawers and like the fridge and stuff like that. And then we're going to do a little bit of cooking. I think that'll be really chill and we can like put some of the food we cook out, like maybe a cake over there or like some, yeah, plates of food on the table. But first I need to empty my pockets so I'll be right back. Okay, I think we're ready for some cooking. I've moved all of our food over into the shelves and the fridge behind me. So I didn't realize, like, obviously you can put stuff in the fridge, but then you can put stuff in the freezer. So I'm not sure what I'd have to freeze, but that's a thing if we need it. <laughs> Got some food in here, more food in here. This, I tried to put things that you'd actually have to refrigerate like in real life in the fridge but it's already full so <laughs> that's a bit frustrating oh i made a cookie jar too look how cute it is it's got a lot of cookies in it well not all our cookies but a lot of them this is our um suspicious stew and poisonous potato cupboard that one's empty for now but yeah we might get cooking um so i was having a little look here i've just typed in like any of the ones that have food in their name to just like have a look at what we can make um, obviously this isn't all the food because there's like the farmer's delight stuff and that we'll have a look at that in a moment but I'm tempted to make some um, boba like some bubble tea that would be pretty cute I think I want to make this sweet berry cake first though and then there's like also like berry juice and like jam and stuff which is pretty cute um, it's like glowberry pie chocolate pie apple pie so they're really cute. These cookies look adorable. Rose cookie, sweetberry cookie, lilac cookie. Like, look how cute that is. <laughs> Can make a breakfast sandwich. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Chicken pickle sandwich. Honey steak sandwich. They're so cute. I don't think I've found any honeydew yet either. So I'll have to keep my eye out for that. Spore blossom jam, honey pot, maple syrup. <laughs> That's really cute. I like that. Chorus fruit jam. 
sweet berry jam, glowberry jam. Yeah, so they're all so adorable. We can just make some pancakes, flavored pancakes, toast. I could love that. Fruit salad, chicken salad, bamboo soup, turtle soup. That's a bit brutal. Yeah, so yeah, I want to start with the sweet berry cake. So I just need some sugar and egg and all of that. So, oh, actually, oh no, I do have sugar. That's okay. Sugar, egg, two wheat, and where did I put the sweet berries? Is it two? I'll just leave them all in my thing. I'm gonna need the crafting table for this one though. How cute. Um, I put it there. Oh my god, I love it. I'm gonna eat a slice though. Oh wait, what? Oh, because I'm not hungry. <laughs> um, and then if I have a look at like all the farmers delight food, like so much food here as well. Can make a hamburger. That's pretty cute. Chicken sandwich. Tomato sauce, raw pasta, a fried egg that looks pretty cute. <laughs> pasta with meatballs. Ooh, mushroom rice. Let's give that a go. Pop that on the table, maybe that could look cute. What else though? Like a whole honey glazed ham. <laughs> Roasted mutton chops. Vegetable noodles look cute. Squid ink pasta. That's pretty cool. Make some sushi roll plates. <laughs> oh, look at the little kettle. Oh, I could put that on the. That would look even cuter than the frying pan. Let's do that. What do I need to make the kettle? Copper bucket, leather, and sticks. Alright, we're doing that. That's adorable. So cute. And then I'll grab some mushrooms because I probably should keep a few mushrooms in the kitchen as well for food. It's pretty big. Can I turn it around? I wonder if it's directional. Oops, a daisy. <laughs> yeah, that's cuter. Okay, I love that. Um, shepherd's pie. That's so cool. So I need some milk, cooked potatoes. I don't think I have any cooked mutton or any raw mutton even, sorry. I haven't really been killing sheep. <laughs> oh wait, I do have mutton. Sorry, I have killed some sheep. There you go. Um, I guess I need like a regular furnace, although I do have these ones over here. And it once had some cooked potatoes as well, didn't it? Two. So we need those and those. Wait, how many was it? Oh wait, is this just not in the cooking pot? Milk, a bowl, two onions. Okay. Two onions. I'll have to grab some more milk because I think I'm- oh no, I've got one more milk. And a bowl. I don't have any bowls on me. I will just eat a suspicious stew. <laughs> I don't even know what that did. Did it do anything? I don't think it did anything. Okay. <laughs> it was like bowl, milk. I was up the top. Oh, wait. Where did my. Oh, I put it <laughs> in the cooking pot. I forgot that hel holds the items. There we go, a shepherd's pie. 
<laughs> a glorious feast. That's so cute. All right, now some little things I think for like next to it. Or is that too much food? Maybe just one more thing. Um, vegetable noodles. No, I'll try the rice, the mushroom rice. That looked pretty cute. Um, rice, one mushroom each, and a vanilla veggie. Rice, and like a potato. Rice, potato, one of those, and one of those. This is my first time ever using a cooking pot. <laughs> Oh, uh, what? Can I? I need a bowl. Is that what it's saying? Yeah, okay, gotcha. Does that mean I can't place it? Ow. Um. Oh well, I guess we made <laughs> some rice to eat. Is there anything else that I can place? Buttered pancakes pretty cute. I think actually didn't I have... where did I put that? Did I... yeah I forgot a few things in here. So I've got these strawberry scones. Can I put them down or do I... can I get a plate and put it in a plate? Because that could work. There's also like decorative plates as well. A white plate. Terracotta plate. Oh uh, yeah. I don't have terracotta on me though do I? Nope. And a white dye. I think it was like that. Make a plate. And then can I dye it? Yeah. Oh, I guess I can stay in there. No, I can't put it on the plate. Okay, what can I put on the plate then? Because that, uh, I guess nothing. I could just make some of this decorative food. Let's make a croissant on a plate. plate with two bread. No, you're not going to work. Wait, is that like a special plate? That is a plate, isn't it? Oh, it's a different plate. <laughs> um, oh, bumblebee chest plate. That's cute. Okay, so th <laughs> three clay balls. Wrong plate. That's why it's not working. I'll make something else to go on the other little tab uh, table place. Oh, oh wait, I need my bread back. There we go. We've got a croissant and then if I grab a sugar I can make the, I think it was like the cinnamon bun. Oh, or a plated blueberry muffin. Whoa, big pancake stack. All right, let's do that. <laughs> That's like so much food. Okay, that looks a bit ridiculous. <laughs> I think it's looking pretty cute in here. I like it. 
I think I'm going to rearrange this room a little bit and I'm going to start, I think, by moving some of the furnaces. I'll move that as well, obviously. Um, into here. Like I might do like a whole wall of furnaces, maybe. I was thinking of making some sort of like super smelter, but I think it might be too hard in the little space. So I might just do like a whole wall of furnaces. Might even take out oh, those two, but I'm gonna have to get some more cobble. Yeah, and then I'll put some other workbenches back here. But Maybe like a couple of tables to put like the um, grindstone and stuff on. Yeah, okay, I'll grab some more furnaces. Pop you there, put the stone cutter on. Actually, no, let's move that over here. Yeah, that's better. And then the little chest in the middle. Oops, no. There, so we've got a wall of might actually make those like four planks later but a whole wall there I need actually some more mossy cobble Like that so now instead of it just obviously being the chests we've got the little furnace area and then we can still do some crafting i might get another light maybe somewhere over here or i could just do the old hide a glowstone block again yeah that's a bit brighter I think that's really cute. We're slowly getting there. Please let me know what you all think of the kitchen. If there's anything you would change or improve. Like I said, I'm really not good at interiors, but I'm trying and I'll keep practicing and see how I go. I think I might leave this episode here and we're going to work on the enchanting room behind me next time. <laughs> going to like rearrange that a little bit and change it up. But for now, thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!